Hey everyone, I wanna to talk to you about email marketing. And specifically one of the biggest missed opportunities that we see when we audit clients email accounts when we bring on new clients one of the biggest things that we see is the lack of automation set up and what i mean by automation flows i'm talking about the welcome series so uh, when someone first joins your list what sort of automated messaging do they get afterwards ideally it's what's called a drip sequence which i never want to speak over everyone's head i assume most of you know what a drip sequence is but if you don't that's where emails are released on a one-to-one -one basis automatically uh, on time or action-based triggers throughout. So that's what's called a drip series. Uh, but the welcome series is super important. Abandoned cart emails, equally important. Uh, abandoned cart emails, on average, uh, reclaim at least 11% of lost sales. So if you don't have an abandoned cart series set up and functioning well, you are leaving a lot of money on the table. So make sure that you're checking out your uh, flows, not only abandoned cart and welcome series, but also browse abandonment, uh, win back flows for people that haven't shopped your site or bought from you in a long time, uh, sunset flows to remove people from your list that aren't engaged, and of course, product review flows, especially for those of you uh, selling on Amazon, that can be very important for you as well. So. Email automation, super important. Uh, it's funny, a lot of times we meet people and they're like, yeah, I send an email once in a while when I get around to it, when I have some time. And, uh, you know, they send a monthly newsletter about 10 times a year. Uh, if that's you, don't worry. There are better options. And automation is a great way to start. Uh, for 99% of you watching this video, I'd recommend Klaviyo, phenomenal software, and they do a, a great job providing bang for buck when it comes to feature set and segmentation. And that's another thing that you've got to make sure that you're getting out of these flows is segmentation. And if you want to know how to segment your customers, you might want to start by asking them. Uh, you know, for example, if you're a uh, consumer packaged goods company, uh, you know, and if you have some products that are gluten free and some that aren't, you know, you might want to find out who cares about gluten free products and who doesn't and not serve the gluten free product line to the people that don't care about that, right? They're, they're, they're not gonna be interested in that. So make sure that you segment your audience as much as possible. You can ask a lot of times it's as simple as running a contest with a gift card attached to it. And I always tell clients, what's the harm in giving away a hundred dollar gift card or whatever in return for that sort of data on your uh, core customers that is invaluable to you in the long run. So make sure that you're paying attention to your automation and segmentation uh, and that will take a lot of the pressure off of uh, make or break email campaigns around the holidays. So it'll sort of uh, spread out the wealth, so to speak, when it comes to generating returns from your email campaigns rather than living or dying by a couple holidays a year, uh, depending on uh, whatever's most relevant to your brand, whether that's Q4 or Father's Day or Mother's Day or whatever the case may be. Instead of having a couple seasonal spikes, uh, great email marketing and automation can really uh, enable you to have uh, steady returns throughout the year by continuing to engage and keep top of mind awareness while adding value. And that's the important part, add value to your audience. If you're not adding value with these emails, trust me, if they don't want one email from you that's valueless, they certainly don't want three or four over the span of a week and a half that don't have any value. So make sure in every single email in these drips that you're adding value. All right, and good luck to you all. And if you need more help, as always, hit us up. And until next time, cheers.